The tape measure tool serves three main purposes in SketchUp. You can measure edges and distances, create dashed construction geometry, and scale individual groups or the whole model uniformly. To measure distances is simple. Click on the first point and pull away to the next point to measure. You don't have to click your mouse, just look in the value control box for the distance value. In this way, you can measure multiple distances from the same point. Tap the Escape key when you're done to finish. Construction geometry is very useful as references in SketchUp. Use the tape measure and click on an edge to pull off a parallel construction edge. This dashed edge extends to infinity in both directions. You can click to finish or type in an exact distance to place the construction edge. If you use a tape measure and click on an endpoint, you will pull off an edge from that point, creating a construction edge and an endpoint. You can also create construction edges by clicking between endpoints and other inference points. Construction geometry can be erased with the eraser tool, or you can erase all construction geometry by going to the edit menu and choosing delete guides. The final use of the tape measure tool is to scale a model or a group. To scale the whole model, use the tape measure tool and measure the length of one edge. This edge measures at 6 inches, which is clearly too small. The correct length should be 8 feet, so type in 8 feet and press enter to accept. Choose yes when asked to resize the model. This scales the entire model in proportion to the distance you entered. You can also scale only an individual group or component without affecting the rest of your model. Simply edit the group then measure an edge and type in the correct value and accept the change. This is useful for individual groups or you can select several objects and then group them together just for the purposes of scaling those objects together without affecting the rest of the model. One other thing to know about scaling the model using the tape measure. When you scale the whole model, it will scale any groups or components you've created with the model, but will not scale any components added from the component library. For example, the people in the sample library are already at the correct scale, so if you add any to your scene, then scale the model with the tape measure tool, those people are not affected.